deserts. Six million eight hundred thousand years ago, Africa Mott, the cradle of life, where rivers. This is the terror bird, the predatory bird that dominated primal Africa. But new beings have appeared in this picture hominids, the primitive ancestors of humankind. Small, fragile, yet daring. As for Laura, a young individual dares to approach a bird's nest where something precious is hidden energy rich eggs that could feed the entire group. At that very moment, the clear disparity emerges. The terror bird is faster, stronger, fiercer. The human is small, slow. Just one strike and that fragile life would end. This is a game of survival, where the strong always seem to have the advantage. But there's one thing the terror bird doesn't possess. Humans know how to cooperate. They know how to throw stones, how to shout, how to distract. Not fangs and claws, but intelligence and unity saved them. This very moment opened a new direction in evolution. Our ancestors survived not through brute strength, but through creativity, perseverance, and unity. Six million eight hundred thousand years ago, humans still trembled in the shadow of monstrous beasts. Six million eight hundred thousand years ago, Africa been tamed the cradle of life, Auslint, a verdant world where rivers, forests, and grasslands nurtured countless giant creatures. This is the terror bird, the predatory bird that dominated primal Africa. They were flightless, but as fast as a cheetah. With its massive hooked beak, one strike was enough to kill any creature. On the savannah, they were the true rulers, Mulza. But new beings appeared in this picture. Hominids, of the primitive ancestors of humankind. Vesritorisus. A young individual dared to approach a bird's nest where something precious lay hidden. Energy rich. In that very moment, the disparity became clear. The terror bird was faster. This was a game of survival, where the strong seemed to always have the advantage. But there was one thing the terror bird didn't have. Humans knew how to cooperate, knew how to throw stones, knew how to shout, knew how to distract, and not fangs and claws, but intelligence and unity saved them. This very moment opened a new direction in evolution. Ancestors didn't survive through muscle, but through creativity, perseverance, and unity. A small group, knowing how to share, knowing how to cooperate, resisted even the giant ruler. This is the true secret of survival. Six million eight hundred thousand years ago, humans still trembled under the shadow of monstrous beasts. Six million eight hundred thousand years ago, Africa, the cradle of life. Rest, a verdant world where rivers, forests, and grasslands nourished countless gigantic creatures. This is the terror bird the predatory bird that dominated primal Africa. They are flightless, but run as fast as a cheetah. With their gigantic curved beak, one strike is... But new beings appeared in this picture. Hominids, the primal ancestors of humankind. A young individual dares to approach a bird's nest containing something precious energy-rich eggs that could feed the whole group. In that very moment, the disparity became clear. The terror bird is faster, stronger, fiercer. The human's small, slow. One strike, and that fragile life will end. This is a game. And our 
ancestors survived not by brute strength, but by creativity, perseverance, and unity. In the quiet embrace of the night, their small triumph was a shared breath. The fire, a beacon of fleeting warmth, etched their fragile existence into the vast canvas of the prehistoric night. From this height, the river became a silver serpent. And the below, an ancient world stirred, a tapestry of grasslands and forests. And then, night cleaned it all, a silent, the girl was a crucible then, unforgiving, yet ripe with possibility. Six million eight hundred thousand years ago, Africa, the cradle of life. But amidst that magnificent spectacle, another story was beginning. The story about our first ancestors. This is the terror bird, the predatory avian species that dominated primeval Africa. They couldn't fly, but they ran as fast as a cheetah. With their enormous curved beak, a single strike was enough to finish off any creature. On the savannah, they were the true rulers. But new beings were appearing in this picture. Hominids, of the primitive ancestors of humankind. Small birds. A young individual dared to approach a bird's nest, containing something precious, energy-rich eggs that could in that very moment, the disparity became clear. The terror bird was faster, stronger, fiercer. The human was small, slow. Just one peck and that fragile life would end. This was a game of survival, where the- But there was one thing the terror bird didn't possess. Humans knew how to cooperate, knew how to throw stones, knew how to shout, knew how to distract. Not fangs and claws, but intellect and unity saved them. That very moment opened a new direction in evolution.